Good morning, everyone. This is Dana from NextGen, and I hope everyone has had a wonderful weekend. If you remember on Friday, we talked about um, streams of income, basically the introduction. And if you haven't seen that, I'll go ahead and put the link up at the top. So I talked about those different streams of incomes, but what I didn't do is I didn't talk about the benefits of having multiple streams of income. So I kind of would like to go over that today. So with anything, you don't want to put all your eggs in one basket. So if you go back to the multiple streams of income, um, one of the ones we talked about was earned income or active income. And that basically relied on your ability to perform. So if you're relying on your 24 hours a day, if something happens to where you lose that ability to perform or there's a furlough or you lose your job, then having your eggs in one basket, you if you lose that one chem if you lose that one income and that's the only income you have, then that's going to be a challenge. And oh, by the way, I know this is my planner and I haven't filled it out yet, but I will. So I just started decorating it. So hopefully you like it. Uh, but the other thing too is that when you have a job or when you have your own business or Let's go with the job. So when you have your have a job, they're only going to pay you what the job is worth, not what you're worth. So the, a lot of times what you're getting paid at work may not match with your financial aspirations. So having multiple income to include having passive income is something that I think would be beneficial. And you're not living paycheck to paycheck. You're not relying solely on that one income to um, sustain you. Also, let's say that one of your incomes was having a rental property. Well, let's say something happens to where that person can't or won't pay rent. Well, you need to find a way to overcome that missing income. So like I said, that's another way of why it's important to have multiple streams of income or even have multiple properties. That's just something that you can look at. Also, having passive income can also free up your time. So let's say that um, you want to take a vacation or you want to take some time away to spend time with your family. Well, if you have earned income or you have a job that requires you to perform, you're not going to be able to spend time with your family as you would want to. Or let's say that there's a family um, emergency or family situation that requires your time. You have the multiple income streams to where you're not dependent upon that one stream of income. So that's another thing. Also, um, you can use your side business or your what the kids call the side hustle to actually turn it into a business. So let's say that you are working a job and you have a desire to do something different. For example, let's say you have a desire to write a book or write multiple books. Well, you have your job as the anchor or the foundation then you start exploring real estate or writing a book or writing blogs or different things that generates other income. Well, that can actually turn into a more lucrative business to where it actually would pay you more than your job. So it allows you to, to explore your creative side, if you will. Then also another thing is that I consider having multiple streams of income as what I call the great equalizer. And this is what I mean by that. If you have a job or, and let's say that you have a fixed income and that's only based on what your ability to perform and the job itself. 
Well, a lot of times people feel as though they're not getting the promotions they feel they should get or they're not getting other opportunities. I tell you, having a having a side or having multiple in um, streams of income, I think is the great equalizer. And if I remember, I'll put it in the description below, but the average income for the millionaires in the country is actually $71,000. So that tells you that having multiple streams of income would actually be to your benefit. So hopefully that helps. Um, like I said, we're going to be doing a um, more, a deep dive, if you will, on the different streams of income and kind of explain for those that may not know of all of the ones that we talked about last Friday. Anyway, have a great week and I will talk to you soon.